Hello and welcome back to Tokyo Extreme Racer 3 on the Banter Gaming Channel. It is time to take on those two technically free bosses, uh, leader of the Rolling Guys and leader of the Waffen SS. Or whatever they are. Hopefully, I'll be the SS there as we know we can. Nah, it's Rolling Guy. That's fine. Know what to do this time. I'm gonna hit him up. We're not going to boost this initial race, if possible. Just got to get him down to his sort of the point where um, the second racer joins, and then we will activate the overboost. Recently we took that corner better than he did. Oh god, we've got a bit of a slide on. There we go. Now we give it all. Ooh, this could work. gaining. Ooh, this is tense. These are just rolling, guys. Why, why is this so difficult? <laughs> uh, I know at least one of you is going to say, oh, it's because you picked a fucking Lancer. It's awful. And, oh, you little bastard! You little bastard! Oh, there we go. And it's definitely time to pit in. But yeah, no, um... Yeah, there's no point in uh, playing with the meta vehicles. May as well give yourself a challenge. There's a pit in just around here. Sure, there is. Where is it? Where's the off ramp? There it is. to take on our next boss. Uh, okay. I wasn't expecting a wanderer. Let alone one in a Daihatsu. <laughs> Look at it go. Jesus. A mortal clown car. 
Fucking, it's taken off. What has he done to that thing to keep up? Seriously. I mean, it sounds like a, a motorbike. <laughs> like a Hayabusa motor or a Blackbird motor or something. Pretty sure I hear him approaching, getting closer. Refined Vagabond. Vagabond now, by the way, as opposed to Lazy, or whatever the fuck it was. Okay, now let's wait up for the guy we're actually meaning to race. Just listen to that thing. <laughs> I don't think there's a handbrake. If there is, I don't know the button. Right. <coughs> Got unfinished business for you, good sir. Would have beat you, but my car crapped out on me last time. I should really start using this more like a curve system. Just, you know, using it for overtakes rather than... There we go. I think we are good to return to the garage now. Oh, got a car that'd be there. Oh, <laughs> nice. That's a move. And a Gloria. Gran Turismo Ultima. Nice. We're still lazily ragabond. Vagabond has still not got new parts. Um, is there anything we can do to this? No. That's really not. Fit better transmission. I don't think adjusting the uh, gear ratio is really going to help much. I eh, don't really need to. I'll get this for a little size of it. Uh, we'll start from Ginza this time. Still do the inner loop, C1. I just take a drink of my tea that I completely forgot about. Mmm. Crap, it's raining. Okay. Wow, 
this is not doing my FPS any good. The fuck? Oh shit. <laughs> oh dear. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> we started we started ahead of him because he fucking hit the wall. Can you please not ram me off the road? Please stop. Rain. Makes it tough to drive in. Rain is really, really tough to drive in. <laughs> I mean, I'm sure you could have figured that out yourself, but yeah. We won, though. We do actually need to go back to the garage, and I think we need to do C1 reverse. Yes. Yes, we do. And I believe we unlocked that. Yes, MR2. Nice. How long is this? You know what? I think I'm going to call the episode here. Um, yeah, that's going to be it. But uh, the only short one today. So, we did a lot. We took on two and a half bosses and two wanderers. So, that's that's a good, good progression there. Still no new parts, but we're working on it. Anyway, thanks again for watching, guys. And I'll see you later.